I'm standing here at, on the uh, front porch of Four Holloway. Uh, you have the 11 Mile Lagoon, part of the 11 Mile Lagoon across the street, as well as the Hickory Cove uh, townhouses, condos over here. And I'll just give you a, a view of the front porch area and front front yard. The steps coming up. Um, are and, and all of the decking is a Trex like product and we'll go on inside now that uh, electric is off so so it'll be a little dark in in here but I'm sure we will have have plenty of light come in and have the staircase off to your right nice foyer area and then a formal study on the first floor Off to the right hand side of the front door, you have your formal dining. Go back around this way. Here is the elevator, and there's a half bath over on, on the right. And then the kitchen off to the right hand side and the formal living living room family room space. And then another another room that faces the, the back of the house because of the, all the porches, of course, it's a little bit darker in here. Um, but this is another media area study. And then they have, have some kind of linoleum here. I don't know if this was a room that they, that maybe they had uh, some games set up in ping pong, you know, just a, a room for, for the kids. This area is over the garage. And then going into the kitchen, there's a nice large cooking stove with the um, pot filler. This goes off into the dining room just to give you an idea of where we're at in the house. Of course, a Sub-Zero in here. We do have uh, an oak cabinet in the kitchen. And then a gas fireplace in the in the breakfast area. Large laundry. Lots of storage in here. And we'll step out onto the it's a little a little office space tucked away over here. We'll step out onto the the porch, which as I mentioned is is a Trex like product and really the stucco doesn't look um, in horrible repairs for, uh, of course as we talked about we would want to have a, an inspection done there is some wood rot here and there like this po on this post the pool is is tucked into the backyard you can see the lagoon back here and a small dock where you can keep a, a little a little boat and um, and or launch kayaks off of. I'm sure when this pool is uh, in its prime, it looks much better. Um, it's a it's a private setting back back in here. We'll go go upstairs and take a look upstairs. Okay, so we are back inside. I'm upstairs on the second floor. down into the foyer so you have the bath ensuite in here with the granite granite top 
Um, again, I can't turn the lights on, but there is a tile surround around that, that bathroom, a gran granite top, and then the oak cabinets again. All of the doors are, are wood, are a solid wood door. These are basically twin rooms. This one does have a shower, a walk-in shower again. I'm sorry, it's dark, but uh, it does have a walk-in shower in this room and then a little bit larger vanity. I can get back and show you with a little bit more light, but it does have a little bit uh, larger vanity in this front bedroom. We do have some built-ins built into the, into the dormers on the front. It's a good use of space in both of these bedrooms and having this window here gives some light into, into this area. And then this master has the has a in the bedroom. Nice walk size walk in closet. A pull down is in here for it to access the attic. And your jetted master tub. Dual sinks. Nice long area here for the sinks. And then your walk-in shower and private commode. Coming out of the master and down another hallway here. We have another good-sized bedroom that faces the back of the house. with twin closets. And a vanity and walk-in, I really can't see in there, but that has a walk-in shower in there as well. So there's a nice combination of tubs and showers in here. And then this is over the game room. And this is just a, either a bedroom um, or, or a media type room um, or overflow, a, a secondary uh, play area, game room. Um, it does not have, there is not a bath up here for that particular room. Uh, the elevator does come up over here, and then there is storage, a storage room built right in. I will um, just get downstairs and get outside and show you the front of the house. So there's a little bit coming out to the front of the house, and I just want to give you an idea of the uh, overall condition. Really, there's some paint up there. Uh, that that it could use but it's in it appears to be in in decent shape again there's going to be some some wood rot here yeah, there, there'll be some of that um, I'm sure all all around the house that just needs some some maintenance some general maintenance done you know along here along these steps and then over on this side of the house you have ooh, you have access to two more garages over here. And then you have the lagoon right here. This is where your gas is buried. Have the neighbor's dog <laughs> barking. Just do a quick walk around. Here's your dock. 
and then the, the pool the pool area and back of the house in here off to the one side over here there were, there's an outdoor shower um, and really as I said the the everything looks in, in in decent shape it just needs a facelift you do have something going on here with the stucco so that definitely is something that needs to be addressed and looked at by a contractor and make sure that there isn't uh, some some deterioration there. Okay, I'm going to um, go on to the next home.